Today, we rebuild the RTG. We're up to 800,000 and we have got rid of Kessler 183 and we purchased her for 125. So it's nice profit, but I did say the other day that I want to really send for a striker and rebuild the club. I've been doing a little bit of grinding off camera in squad battles. I thought, you know, I had some spare time. I'll throw together this team. So we have an 80 plus times five, but not only that, season progress 85 plus times two and i'm not sure if today they're going to be dropping enough xp so we can go and claim either kunya or kone i think i want kone to be honest and then that could be a very nice replacement to kessler 80 plus times five trailblazer no it's not edin jeko striker so it's only an 83 yeah these haven't been two kinds they never really give out like these 80 plus times fives knobs oh Nah, it's not very good. 85 plus times two. I'll take a Virgil van Dijk from this so I can sell the one that I've got on. German center mid. Not sure. Tony for the rating. Pretty good. What is he this year? 86. Double. Oh, Oberdorf. A double German pack. 87 and 86. Team of the week's been refreshed again. Three players we could benefit from. Jude, Salah, Son. One of the three would be great. And then I make even more coins and probably buy Bon Matty. Hold on, goalkeeper. Hey, yo, hold on a minute. 84, Olivier Giroud. I don't think I suck him into an SBC. He's another one that's going to have to get discarded. Show us, Salah. Sentiment Mikatarian. Oh, I don't actually want to sell his Trailblazers card or like that version. He's pretty good. And he's definitely better than the Inform because I did actually use this card as well. I'm buying Rudy Voller. I'm absolutely buying Rudy Voller, boys. Rudy Voller, welcome him to the RTG. Seriously, I really do believe this is what I want right now. Striker, attacking the ball, finishing, chip shots, and finesses. It's Rudy Voller. 620 does seem like a good price. It's always very difficult to find that top quality striker that gives you a little bit of everything. Now, although he doesn't have the skills, we're going to be bringing in some very nice players in the midfield to help assist that. And we're going to look for his movement and just keep short shooting, keep scoring. De Jong, how good was he? Like two years ago, three years ago, his team of the year was literally one of the best enemies I've ever used on ultimate team. Every time I face up against him, he's playing better than 82 interceptions. This man is everywhere. There's obviously like a few people that aren't clued up with the game that are going to be listing him for 49,000. Oh, it's not even a good deal. All right, 49,000 though, 750. Welcome to Stegen. I really hope you play well for us. I've gone through what, Oblak, Mike Minyan, Hope, I didn't really like that much, thought it was a liability. Allison, one of the best goalkeepers, and now Tostegan gets a chance. Anka Kemstahl on our brand new Bombasta. Well, we haven't made it official yet, but like I say, she has fantastic play styles. The anticipate for a fullback is huge, and the whip pass to Rudy Voller could be amazing. I'm also very close to unlocking Kone from the season progress. So if we bring him in, we might have like some slight chem issues, but at least Rudy provides that Bundesliga link. So we've got an eye on a few of these cards, especially De Jong, because he's brand new. And well, Rudy, a times two multiplier engaged. And it's at this point where I choke. Bruno, De Bruyne, son. Go on. Bait a little cut back. It's nice. That's actually a really good run. Oh my God, Sam on side. Sam on side. Musala. I'm on side. Rudy. Strength. Just pass it off. Overlap me, Rudy. Near post. Oh, get in there, Rudy. Come on, man. Unless I get a lucky rebound. No, he's got Mendy. I wouldn't mind Mendy, but 100,000 coins for him. Come on. No, Cavalieri. Ah, oh, I moved the keeper way too. Oh, don't let me bottle. Oh, he's going to get that. Oh, that's good play, to be fair. Oh, Virgil, though, just so good. Let's whip that across. His midfield stepping up big time now. Son. No, it's a goal. No. <gasps> Rudy Voller. Oh, hold on. I'm going to cook him. Rudy. Virgil. Come on, Virgil. We're coming up against a German, but this has got to be a must win. And he's all got the sweat in his team, yep. Oh, god damn. Easy. This is nice, though. Kim son, where are you? Bellingham. Good dribbling. 
Please, De Jong. Yeah, I, I like De Jong and I hate De Jong. Ready. That's gorgeous. Rudy. Hey. Oh, no, he ain't not like this. Not like this. Big header. What a pass from Rudy. Oh, this is nice. And they're over the top. Good. Keep that alive. Really nice play. Rudy, finesse shot. Come on. There it is. Good challenge. Oh, no, I'm panicking. Good, 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 good. Remember switch. Remember, because, you, you know. Bang. And then human son. Yes, this is nice. Then Rudy. Then son. Then human son. No, 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 no. Does he go for a finesse? Nah. There's no chance to draw it like that. Grape juice season. I need some juice right now from this team. It was an embarrassing performance in the second half from the boys. This is the win. All right, you've got that though. Ready? No. Colin Mwani. And he's got that. With 78 composure. Through. Yes, that's nice. Son, 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 son. Rudy. Finesse, finesse yours. Has to, has to. Yes. He's still going to get that? No. Oh, not a good throw in at all. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. <laughs> oh, yes. Human, human. He's got, he's got five. No, he doesn't have five star weak foot. Of course he doesn't. He must, he's got, probably got Trevella. Well, that's a, he... Nah, Colo Mawani. Through ball. Uh, uh, uh. Rudy Voller, yes! Across. Rudy, well played. Nice composure, Rudy. Uh, let's do one of these. Oh, just finish the game. Please seal it for me. De Jong, that's lovely speed. Whack it back post because I think someone's there. I've done it. I've done it. I've done it. I've done it. Oh, the relief. I've done it. It's taken us a while, honestly, but we have been going through different teams, trying out you know, some fun players, but now it's all about building a strong side. So finally, we reached the checkpoint in Division 1, which is genuinely embarrassing considering how many times I've bottled that opportunity. 10, 15. I've been stuck in Division 1 for the past week, but then again, I've been going through different formations, tactics, teams, and I've just tried to find my feet a little bit. And knowing how I was playing, I probably didn't deserve that much, if I've got to be brutally honest. But looking at the improvements that I've made personally into my own game, adding in a few more skill moves, and just getting that into muscle memory. Because the worst thing is trying to have to think about which way you're putting it off. Now everything is feeling a little bit more natural. I've got creativity, and I'm a little bit more unpredictable with how I'm building up. Uh, against the opponent so that really has added to my game and not to mention the team is starting to get a lot better with the human son the seller in the side and then with our new purchase which is Rudy Voller so Robbie Keane we had to say goodbye to him for 300,000 and we brought in Rudy which is double the price but is it double the performance and at this moment in time I haven't personally seen it which is just me being honest but the finishing is there with Rudy. The pace is definitely an improvement to get in behind. And I think once I start coming up against like just the regular foot champs opponents, uh, easier games, I think Rudy is going to turn up differently. But this is a card that has been able to give us our best form yet in divisions. So obviously something has worked. And his finishing is nice. Like you will see some quality goals because I was playing like extra games. And with the acrobaticness with the, with the card and what he offers with the finesse shot, the power header, and that's exactly what I wanted to bring in. Someone that can lead the line properly and is more well-rounded than Robbie Keane. And I think we've found that. I think we have, but it's just, I believe we can get more out of the cards. So his level is decent, but I believe he could offer a lot more. So absolutely will he be staying for a foot champs weekly run. I think he is going to be insane for us. And then you look at the left back position, uh, the Bombastor I was using a little, little bit earlier before we started like pushing for the promotion. 
uh, or at least the safety zone in Division 1. And she's very good on the ball, really smooth. Her whipped crosses as well were great. I think that at times when she was tracking back, she was a little bit weak in that play. So I don't believe she's the best fullback I've ever used, but she is offering quite a lot to her game. And then I've had a little look at Lazarazu. I haven't tried him, but I might buy him off the market. He's about 200k, but he's also got the whip cross that I'm looking for. And then just, you know, other stats that he's providing looks really good. So maybe I'll go for him or Fulham Mendy that's 100,000. I don't know if he's worth buying for that. So I'm basically looking for a left back that gets chemistry, but I'm also considering bringing in that Kone into the side. So I've got to think about Bundesliga links as well. So maybe that hero wouldn't be a bad idea. But I was scoring some really nice goals with Rudy Volla. Like, you would have seen them just then. Like, they are crazy. The, the volley as well to the near post. Like, come on, Rudy Volla. But let me go and show you what I've done with some of the players that I sold. A few of them I didn't want to get rid of, but I just needed the coins. And especially now, I have to, like, finish off the team. Like, I just, I'm desperate for coins. So let me go and show you what I've done, and we'll speak about the other players. Let's go. So Kessler, you would have seen that was sold. Mikitarian, I really wanted to keep him, especially as an impact sub, because right now I cannot get chemistry in the slightest with him being from Syria. I'm mainly going for La Liga Premier League. And even then, it's like quite difficult because I'm going to add in some Bundesliga players. So Mkhitaryan, absolutely no way. And coming off the bench for 70,000, I wouldn't have minded that for the price. But because I've had to get rid of Testegen, because you know the 89s have basically nearly gone extinct. Well, he's inflated. He used to be like 20, 25,000. Now, my idea is was to test this build and he was very good and buy him back on Friday just before I play foot champions. I think that's pretty smart. Mike Minian, we don't need now, sold for 24. So I'm just trying to do some like management, you know, club management. And I feel like that was a good idea. You know, someone else I was thinking of selling and buying back, Mohamed Salah. That man's 268,000 coins. And I mean, we originally bought him or the one before the pack pulled Salah for 220. So this one, we could make like quite a bit of money which would be amazing. Even Human Son, I think we had bought him for, is it 60k? And I think Son's now like uh, nearly 100, like 89, yeah, 89,000, which is unbelievable. But I wanted to speak about uh, De Jong because this is a card that feels unbelievable to step through the challenges, press proven, like he gives you a lot on the ball and his passing for the most part was really nice. Some of them I thought he would be able to play a little bit better, but that's probably just, you know, making some mistakes on my part. But he really is a good player, just finishing rubbish. Unless it was the Travella shot that I scored, which was like pretty, pretty lucky for a rebound. I just do not like his finishing in the slightest when I get him inside the box. It is weak. You can't like finesse with him with any power. Like, oh, I don't know. I just didn't really like the shot across goal that he missed. So I would love to find someone like De Jong, but just better and more well-rounded. But for now, I think he's fine and he does provide very nice chemistry to Ronald, which was a fantastic idea to bring him back in the starting 11. And then with Oblak, I was just like coming up with an idea. Like to Stegen's good. To Stegen, Oblak, all of these goalkeepers that I've used, Mike Mignan, they're absolutely fine. So I really couldn't care less if it's to Stegen or Oblak. But just because of chemistry and stuff, I think... Well, whatever, whatever we decide to do. But Lazarazu, I really seriously got my eye on him. And then Kone will be being brought uh, to the team, absolutely. So we'll have to drop Tenali for the time being. And then this man here, Rudy, 17 games, 14 goals, 4 assists, which I think that's a good return. You can see already that he's more or, or less he wants to be that goal scorer instead of Robbie Keane, like dropping into the midfield and setting up other people. And that's fine. That's really what I'd like as well, just having someone so dominant to get in behind. So we're going to start settling down with Rudy and play a lot better. But you would have seen the goals anyway. Like, he is top quality. So this is the build. And I brought back Bellingham as well, who's been fantastic. So I like it. I really like it. But the only issue is now bringing in these guys from the Bundesliga has affected the chemistry to the Premier League. And I don't know how much of a difference that's going to make to them in game with, like, hitting the finesse shots consistently. So I'm like, again, it's... I'm, I'm trying to make upgrades and I'm trying to work chemistry. It's like really annoying. I just wish that it wasn't like this, but I am liking the fact that we've made the changes that we have, like two quality center backs. Midfield was quite nice when I used it and the attack is just beautiful, like very, very nice. So overall, I'm pretty happy, but upgrades we will continue to make and then we'll have the Thursday rewards that I'll probably just take like the coins again, like rank three is pretty good. For the 40,000 that will really help us make some extra signings. But thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow. Take care, enjoy the rest of your evening and day. Goodbye, God bless, and take care. Peace.